The world we live in is ever-changing, and the future of urban living is no exception. With the convergence of environmental issues and resource depletion, humanity has been forced to rethink the way urban areas are designed. In the 22nd century, the concept of arcologies emerged as a radical departure from traditional urbanism, condensing an entire city into one massive structure. In this video, we will explore the concept of arcologies, their evolution, and their impact on urban living. The Emergence of Arcologies The refugee crisis that emerged in the mid-21 st century has now largely subsided, with much of civilization having been relocated to the polar regions of northern Europe, Russia, Canada, and western Antarctica. In order to accommodate so many people in such a smaller area, cities have become increasingly dense and self-contained. Decades of concerted geoengineering efforts have led to success in stabilizing global temperatures. Combined with ongoing population pressures, this has prompted governments to begin repopulating some of the abandoned regions in more central latitudes. However, most countries still face the problems of resettling hyper-arid, ecologically ravaged environments. This is where the concept of arcologies comes in. The evolution of arcologies. The concept of arcologies is not new. The first centrally planned, truly sustainable cities were constructed in the 2020s. Later in the 21st century, these principles were adapted for the development of single structures, resulting in super-tall skyscrapers that combined vertical farming with residential and commercial space, recycling and production systems for energy, water, and other resources. By the 22nd century, these towers had evolved into some of the mightiest structures ever built. They are so massive that some cover several kilometers in girth, typically rise over 1.5 kilometers in height, and accommodate millions of people. Some are partially or fully merged into mountainsides and other landscapes, resembling enormous ant colonies, and living up to their portmanteau of architecture and ecology. These structures have been made possible through advances in materials science, with carbon nanotubes utilized to cope with the massive forces involved. The sheer size and strength of arcologies make them virtually immune to earthquakes, hurricanes, and other disasters. Self-contained structures. Each arcology is a self-contained structure that holds everything it needs for human survival. Automation is ubiquitous, with intelligent robots managing almost all construction and maintenance. Highly efficient transport systems are located throughout to move travelers horizontally, vertically, or diagonally. Advancements in elevator technology have made lifts capable of whisking riders up in a single trip, no matter what height, as opposed to changing halfway up. This kind of hyper-dense urban environment allows movement around a city at speeds unheard of in previous centuries. Low environmental impact. These radical new designs exemplify an overall trend in recent human development. Low environmental impact. Globally, cities and their connecting infrastructure are slowly being retracted, giving over more land to nature. Advances in transportation and civil engineering, combined with nanoscale manufacturing, are enabling humans to operate with little or no impact on the environment. Though classically designed cities still exist, the arcology represents a fundamental shift in the balance between humans and nature. The future of urban living. Arcologies could revolutionize urban living in the 22nd century by providing a self-contained environment that accommodates all human needs while minimizing environmental impact. With the world's population continuing to grow, space will become increasingly scarce and traditional urban planning will no longer suffice. Arcologies can create new jobs and industries, especially in areas where traditional urban development is no longer feasible, such as in engineering, construction, maintenance, vertical farming, and sustainable energy production. The development of arcologies also represents a significant investment in infrastructure, stimulating economic growth and development. However, potential challenges include the hyper-dense nature of these environments, making it difficult for residents to form meaningful connections with others outside their community, leading to social issues such as depression and anxiety. Additionally, the cost of developing and maintaining these structures may create financial challenges for governments and private investors if the structures fail to generate sufficient revenue to cover their maintenance costs. That's all for this video. Please like, subscribe, and turn on notifications to stay informed about future videos. Until then, take care. Thank you for watching. Thank you.